hello everyone so in this video i will show you how you can create a mockup from scratch so i have downloaded these two images from pexels.com and pexels.com is a website from where you can uh, download images a uh, high quality images and you can use them commercially or personally and you don't have to mention every anyone so i have just downloaded those two images and then i will just copy the logo from illustrator file you can use your vector file and just copy the logo and then paste it in photoshop i will just choose pixels and then just hit on check mark and then i will just uh, press ctrl plus t or free transform and then i will right click on it and go to distort and i will distort my image for the accuracy and after placing it here I will just press check mark and then press ctrl plus t again and then resize it so as you can see it fit, fits perfectly in the perspective and then I will right click on the layer and then convert to smart object so we have converted it in sub smart object because we are going to add blur on this image so I will just go to filter blur and then Gaussian blur and add a little bit blur to it so it looks a little bit more realistic and then I will press ok so for more realistic look you can just place a copy of your logo in this so it will look like it's the reflection of the logo so I will just press and press ctrl plus j to copy our layer or you can right click and then duplicate layer and then just uh, place the copy of your layer here and then just resize it a little bit and then hit on the check mark so I will just blur it a little bit more so that's it now I will place our logo here also I will create another mockup I will just press and uh, press ctrl plus c and then just ctrl plus v here hit ok hit check mark again and then ctrl plus t or free transform right click on it and then distort so I will distort this and then I will press ctrl plus t again and resize it so that's how you can create a mockup of your logo from scratch so you can find any image on pexels.com unsplash.com or any kind of these websites where you can you don't have to mention any anyone's name and you can use those images commercially you can use your logo on that kind of images freely and with this method you don't have to worry about the perspective you can perfectly place your logo in perspective with this me method i hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching